How's it going everyone? Squabbled here. Today I'm going to be showing you how to get the old Minecraft launcher back in 2021. So, first thing you want to do is make sure you're signed into your Microsoft account or your Mojang account, depending on if you migrate. Go ahead and get Minecraft, computer, PC, Minecraft Java Edition, download, and download for Windows 7 slash 8. Even if you're on Windows 10, you can click on this, or Windows 11, it doesn't really matter. This is just the older version of the launcher that's not through the Windows Store. So, I already have it downloaded. I've downloaded it a million times. <laughs> so, just go ahead and run it, and you should see, you know, the creeper and the skeleton. Let's go ahead and next. And if you, already, if you see this screen, that means you've already installed it. You can't install it again. So go ahead and cancel. If you don't have it installed, just go ahead and install it. It's pretty straightforward. And then close out the the setup. So now you should see the Minecraft launcher icon on your desktop. However, there's something that we do need to do before we actually run it. So go ahead and right click on it. Properties. Compatibility. Run this program in compatibility mode 4. And click on Windows 7. So go ahead and apply. And now when we open it up, as you can see, there's no more pop-up at the bottom telling you upgrade to the new launcher. As you can see, um, all of my installations are here. And um, I can fully use this launcher. It's a lot nicer than the Windows 11 launcher. So... If you're on Windows 7, you don't actually have to do that compatibility thing. It's just so that Windows 10, it, it's for Windows 10 users basically. So it just basically tricks you into, it tricks the launcher into thinking it's running on Windows 7. So it doesn't prompt you to get the Microsoft Store version. That's basically why you have to do it. If you're on Windows 7 or 8, doesn't matter. And you should have all your installations and everything unless you cleared it when you uninstalled it but yeah that's pretty much it uh there's another thing and that is if you have game pass when you type in minecraft launcher you have two minecraft launchers as you can see this one has a smaller icon you can tell this is the microsoft version it just comes with the game pass if you download minecraft but you're going to want to launch this version if you want to launch Java. And you should be able to just get your Minecraft. Even if you have just Game Pass, you should be able to just sign in from the side. And get your um, get your Xbox Live email and password in. And that should just let you play on your um, Game Pass account. So, yeah. Uh, if you have any questions, leave a comment. If you have any problems, leave a comment. Uh, this worked, leave a thumbs up. If this didn't work, leave a thumbs down. You know, be just just tell everyone what you think of the video if it works. And I hope you enjoyed, and I hope this helped you. So thank you for watching, and goodbye.